greetings and happy new year. Remember I had mentioned something about guitar on wish.com that was supposed to be 50 cents. Well, that guitar never did come about because, you know, it was just a ploy to get you to buy something. Uh, there was no way in hell they were going to give that guitar for 50 cents plus 25 cents of shipping. So, uh, there is a booby door prize, though. For about $70, I did get something else. <laughs> uh it's in the box, not the other guitar sitting next to it. So we're going to take a look inside this box and see what I got for essentially $68. Alrighty, so this guitar actually arrived with the box damaged. Um, I don't know if this was by UPS or if that was when it transitioned over to the United States Postal Service or if it was just uh, an accident from our delivery person. I really don't know. But anyway, let's open this up and let's see what's in here. Now mind you, this is off wish.com. Um, it's not even a name brand for this particular one, to be honest. So, we will see what we're getting very, very soon. Just bursting the tape on the box so I can get in there. So we do have a guitar that's actually in styrofoam. And what do we have here? The items that came with it. So this is a little strap that came with it and it has guitar pick included. And this is just the whammy bar, as people call it. And you have the Allen wrenches in there for the truss rod. And of course, a cable. And there's also the gig bag that came with this guitar. All right, so let's see here. Nice looking little head stock there. Like I said, there's no name brand. Crazy, right? There's nothing even on the back indicating where it was made, consumer marks, nothing. I mean, nothing. Really crazy. So, let's finish the unveil. This one is a little shy. It doesn't want to show it, so. Ha <laughs> ha. Alright. Oh, look at that. Looks like something that would have been from possibly ESP, a Kirk Hammett model that's out there. The 
binding and the back is white. That really makes it stand out. The uh, body is supposed to be just basswood or basswood, however which way you want to say it. And it's supposed to be a maple neck with a rosewood fretboard, 22 frets. No idea what the hardware is because there was no indication. <laughs> so we don't know who the manufacturer would be for the pickups, the volume and tone pots, the selector switch, which is three-way, and this very basic uh, tremolo that's in there. Hopefully it actually does its job. Of course that's not in tune. So let's see. I'm gonna do a little bit of work to get this guitar together and then we'll see what it's capable of doing. See you in a little bit. Okay so the most I've done is clean up the guitar a little bit and I just tuned it up. That's it. I didn't do anything with the action. Um, let's just see what this guitar is able to do. It's about 78 bucks on Wish.com. So let's see what we get here. <laughs> too bad <laughs> for the price it's crazy <laughs> the action is definitely high on here I have to bring it down so far, not bad for a guitar that's only $78, and that included shipping. So... <laughs> I came to realization as to who the manufacturer is, even though it's not on the headstock. See, I have a Tele copy that you saw earlier sitting next to the box. It's a company by the name of Glary. They're out of New Jersey, I believe. Okay, so this is the name brand right there. And um, if you look, they're the same headstock. The tuning pegs have some uh, white film on them. I don't know if you could see that too clearly, but this guitar also happens the same have the same exact white film on it <laughs> all right so being that the headstock is exactly the same same tuning pegs um, yeah this is a glary guitar as a matter of fact on the box the model number is a g666 really <laughs> number of the beast but we've got lightning so far i think it's a pretty decent guitar I will work on it to get the action where I want it to be. Perhaps put a, a different set of strings, maybe an 8 gauge, and uh, see how it works at that point. But right now, I'm actually quite surprised and quite pleased for the price. You might want to check it out. <laughs> 